covenant of healing. Der Bund des Heilung, der Heilung. God is Jehovah Rapha. Je, äh, Gott ist Jehovah Rapha. Is our healer. Er ist unser Heiler. Is our healer. Er ist unser Heiler. Is our healer. Er ist unser Heiler. Isaiah 53 says, by his stripes we were we are healed. Durch seine Wunden sind wir schon geheilt. Now, 1 Peter 2:24 quotes Isaiah 53, but uh, I like uh, I like how it's written in uh, verse 24 in 1 Peter. He says, "He himself bore our sins in his body on the cross, so that we might might die to sins and live for righteousness." By his wounds you have been healed. Der unsere Sünden selbst hinaufgetragen hat an seinem Leib auf das Holz, damit wir der Sünde abgestorben, der Gerechtigkeit leben. Durch seine Wunden seid ihr heil geworden. I like this, this chapter, this verse. Ich liebe diesen Vers. Because it speaks it, it tells us it's a past tense. Denn hier steht es in der Vergangenheitsform. It's a done deal. Es ist schon getan. It says, by his wounds you have been healed. Durch seine Wunden seid ihr heil geworden. It's a done deal. Es ist schon getan. So, If it's a done deal, you just have to claim it. Also wenn es doch schon getan wurde, muss es nur beanspruchen. You just have to claim it. Du kannst es einfach annehmen. And say I am healed. Du kannst sagen, ich bin geheilt. The same way I've testified when boils were all, was all over my back and no doctor could do or no medicine could help me. Genauso wie ich damals bekannt habe, als keiner mir helfen konnte. And I got a revelation from Galatians chapter 3. Und ich habe diese Offenbarung aus Galater 3 bekommen. That Christ has redeemed me from every curse of the law. Dass Christus mich befreit hat von jedem Fluch. I went about declaring. Und ich habe es bekannt. I am the healed of the law. Ich bin geheilt von I'm Gott. redeemed from the curse of the law. Ich bin befreit von dem I, Fluch. I started denying every 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 effects of boil in my body. Und ich habe angefangen alle Effekte oder negativen Dinge zu verneinen. Until I was completely healed. Bis ich ganz geheilt war. And the same way we need to do. Und genauso müssen wir das auch tun. When we study deep into the word of God and he sees that the covenant of healing is our portion. Wenn wir lesen in Gottes Wort, dass ähm, der Bund des Heils uns gehört. Let us passionately with a passion go for healing. Let's pray for healing. Lass uns leidenschaftlich für diese Heilung beten. Amen. Amen. Because God says Ah, for I am the Lord who heals you. Den Gott selbst sagt zu dir, ich bin der Gott, der dich heilt. I am the Lord who heals you. Ich bin der Herr, der dich heilt. I'm Jehovah Rapha. Ich bin Jehovah Rapha. Let's just rise up on our feet and let's just claim healing for ourselves. Let's pray for healing for our family members. If you know somebody who's sick, let's pray for healing. Lass uns aufstehen und für unsere Heilung beten. Let, let, let's let's just start praying for healing. Lass uns für die Heilung beten. Any person, if you know you are sick, I want you to come in front as we pray and believe God together with you. Wenn du gerade krank bist, dann komm bitte nach vorne und wir werden für dich und deine Heilung. We are going to believe God for complete healing. Wir beten und wir glauben daran, dass Gott uns ganz No sickness is going to stay in your body. Keine Krankheit wird mehr. We allow no infirmity. We allow no infirmity. Church, let's pray. Let's pray. Let's pray. We've heard the word of God. Which says the prayer of faith will heal the sick. The prayer of faith. The prayer of faith. The effectual prayer of a righteous man availeth much. For the people who are in front, just claim, just declare, healing is my portion. I receive healing. We name healing an. Touch wherever you're hurting and just claim healing. And the people who are standing at the back, I just want you to stretch forth your faith. Stretch forth your hand and agree together with those who are standing in front. Because the word of God says there is power in the prayer of agreement. When two of us agree concerning a thing, concerning a situation here on earth, it will be done for us by our Father in heaven. In fact, Matthew chapter 18, Amplified says this, Amplified version says this, if two of us here on earth declare that a thing is lawful here on earth 
um, dass irgendeine Sache getan wird auf dieser Erde. It will be done for them by our Father in heaven. Wenn sie sich einig werden, dann wird es getan. If von, two of, von or three of us agree concerning uh, something here on earth. Wenn zwei oder drei irg auf irgendetwas sich einig werden. And agree that is unlawful. Und sich einig werden über die Sachen. It will be done for us in heaven. Dann wird es für uns getan werden. So today as a church. Also heute als Gemeinde. We agree. Um, werden wir uns einig, that we are in a covenant of healing. Dass wir in einem Bund der Heilung sind. Healing is our portion. Heilung gehört uns. And we refuse every sickness. Und wir verneinen jede Krankheit. We refuse every infirmity. Wir verneinen jede Schwäche. We refuse every weakness. Wir verneinen jede Schwäche. Or on our behalf. Und für uns. Or in any family member. Oder für jeden um, Familienmitglied. We declare the word of God. We say by the stripes of Jesus we were healed. Let's confess together by the stripes of Jesus by the stripes of Jesus we were healed. By the stripes of Jesus I was healed. It is a damn thing. It is a damn thing. Jesus became a curse by hanging on the tree that I may be redeemed from the curse of the law that I may receive healing therefore in the name of Jesus I claim my healing I claim my covenant benefits I claim my healing I declare in Jesus name healing is my portion healing is my portion I refuse this sickness I refuse this sickness I do not allow this sickness to dwell anymore in my body I do not allow this infirmity to stick itself anymore in my, in my body. I declare in Jesus' name I am healed. I declare in Jesus' name I am made whole. I declare in Jesus' name I am strong. I am strong. I am strong. The one of God says, let those who are weak declare that I am strong. I declare that you are strong in Jesus' name. I declare that you are healed in Jesus' name. You are healed. Healed. I speak healing. Healing in our bodies. Healing in our families. Healing in our marriages. Healing in our personal relationships. In the name of Jesus Christ. Healing. It's our portion. God says, I am the Lord that heals you. I am the Lord that heals you. I'm Jehovah Rapha. I am your healer. Just lift up your hands and just receive. I am the Lord that Lift your hands and just receive. I am the Lord, you are here. I sent my wife and you, your is I am the Lord, you are here. I am the Lord, I am the Lord. I am the Lord, your healer. I sent my wife and your is I am the Lord, your healer. I am the Lord, the Trinity, the healer. I am, I am the Lord, your healer. I sent my wife and you are deceased. I am the Lord, your healer. You are the Lord, you are the Lord, not healing me, not healing me. You are the Lord, my healer. You 
sent, who sent your word, and you are exist. I am the Lord, my healer. You are the Lord, you are the Lord. The healer, me, the healer, healer. You are the Lord, my healer. Sent your one, sent your one, and you are his peace. You are the Lord, my peace. Let's confess it in German. Ich bin der Herr, der dich schreit. Ich bin der Herr, dein Heiler. Ich schick mein Wort. Ich bin der Herr, ich bin der Herr, der dich heilt, der dich heilt. Ich bin der Herr, dein Heiler, ich schick mein Wort, wenn du dich mein Kind, ich bin der Herr, dein Heiler. Ich bin der Herr, Ich bin der Herr, dein Herr, ich schick, ich schick mein Wort, er hört dich mein Kind, ich bin der Herr, dein Herr, I am the Lord, I am the Lord, but he let me, that he let me, I am, I am the Lord. Ich möchte dieses ähm, Gebet des Glaubens versiegeln. I want to seal our prayers of faith. Ich möchte unsere Gebete des Glaubens versiegeln. In the name of Jesus. Im Namen Jesu. And I want to declare. Und ich erkläre. That we are healed. Dass wir geheilt sind. According to your word. Nach deinem Wort. I want to declare by faith. Möchte ich im Glauben bekennen. I declare by faith in the name of Jesus that it is so. It is so according to the word of God. According to the word of God. If an agreement shout, Amen. Amen. And I want us to take a step of faith. If you could not do something Before the prayer, if, if there's something that uh, the, the infirmity that made you, you could not do something, I just want you to step, do a, take a step of faith and just do something you could not do. If you could not jump, just jump around and say, I am healed. Take a step of faith and say, God says, when he put his word into practice, he confirms his dann bestätigt er sein Wort With signs. mit Zeichen. As the disciples went about preaching the gospel, God confirms His word with signs and wonders. Gott ähm, hat sein Wort bestätigt mit Zeichen und Wunder. We are still living in times of signs 
and wonders. Und wir leben immer noch in der Zeit von Zeichen und Wunder. And I believe in deep down in my heart God wants to do greater things. Und ich glaube ganz tief in meinem Herzen Gott möchte große We are going to see God doing greater things in our midst. Gott wird große Dinge tun unter uns. Because as I've been saying God is alive and active now. Denn Gott ist lebendig und aktiv jetzt. Say now. Sag jetzt. God is alive and active. Gott ist lebendig und aktiv. Amen. 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 Let's open our Bible in Luke 22 verse 19. Lass uns unsere Bibeln aufschlagen in Lukas. As we continue in this atmosphere of faith as we go sit down but let's continue in this atmosphere of faith. Lass uns weiter im Glauben bleiben. Jesus gave us a commandment. Gott hat uns einen Auftrag gegeben. That we should remember what he did for us. What he did for us. And today, according to the topic we're dealing with today. Today we are talking about the covenant of healing. Today we are going to remember, we're going to remind ourselves. That is our, our covenant is a covenant of healing. Dass in unserem Bund auch Heilung ist. We are going to remind ourselves by taking of communion. Wir werden uns daran erinnern durch das Abendmahl. And we are going to take it in a thankful we, we're going to do it in a thankful mood. Wir müssen das ähm, in Dankbarkeit tun. We are going to take it by faith. Und wir werden es im Glauben tun. That we are healed. Dass wir geheilt sind. That we are made whole dass wir ganz gemacht that we are restored dass wir wiederhergestellt sind because that is god's will denn das ist gottes wille from us for us von gott für uns i want the altar ministers to just come in front verse 19 he says and jesus took bread and gave thanks and broke it and gave them saying this is my body given for you do this in remembrance of me do this in remembrance of me do this in remembrance of me und er nahm das brot dankte und brach es und gab es ihnen und sprach das ist mein leib der für euch gegeben wird das tut zu meinem gedächtnis jesus said jesus sagte this is my body given for you dies ist mein leib der für euch gegeben wird do this in remembrance of me das tut zu meinem gedächtnis i want to request the altar ministers just to distribute the bread and we are going to pray for it and then we are going to partake of it together lass uns für das brot, brot beten und das zusammen einnehmen the altar ministers they distribute the bread I am the Lord that he lets I am the Lord that he I sent my wife and you are here I am the Lord that he I am the Lord I am the Lord that he led me I am the Lord Jah I sent I sent my wife and you that is this I am the Lord Jah I am the Lord I am the Lord Don't you let me that he lends Oh I am the Lord Your healer I sense sent my wife and you are his I am the Lord Your healer Father in Jesus name. We thank you for a time like this. Where we can remember what you did for us on the cross. Father, as we remember you. 
As we remember what you did for us on the cross. We first want to pray for forgiveness. Where we've sinned against you. Where we've gone our own way. Where we've rebelled against you. Father, we pray for forgiveness for each and every person in this place. But even as we remember you, wenn wir uns an dich erinnern, we remember you in a worthy manner. Ähm, dass wir das in einer würdigen Weise tun. We receive forgiveness of every sin. Und wir nehmen die Vergebung an für jede Sünde. And we thank you, Father. Und wir danken dir, Vater. And Lord, we thank you for this bread. Und wir danken dir, Vater, für dieses Brot. You took the bread. Du hast das Brot genommen. You broke it. Du hast es gebrochen. And you gave thanks. Du hast dafür gedankt. Father, we thank you for this bread. Vater, wir danken dir für dieses Brot. Which represents your body. Das für deinen Leib steht. That was given for us. Der für uns gegeben wurde. Thank you. Danke. For every covenant benefit. Danke für jeden, jede Wohltat aus deinem Bund. And you partake this bread. Wir essen von diesem Brot. With, with so much thankfulness in our hearts. Mit so viel Dankbarkeit in unserem Herzen. And you bless the Lord. Und wir segnen dich. In Jesus name. In Jesu Namen. Let's partake of the bread. Lass uns das Brot essen. Verse 20. In the same way, after the supper, I took the cup, saying, This cup is the new covenant in my blood which is poured out for you. Vers 20 des gleichen auch den Kelch nach dem Mahl und sprach dieser Kelch ist der neue Bund in meinem Blut das für euch vergossen wird. This cup is the new covenant in my blood which is poured out for you. Dieser Kelch ist der neue Bund in meinem Blut das für euch vergossen wird. Alter ministers let's just distribute the cup. You are Lord that he led me. You are the Lord my healer. You say to one and heal my sins. You are the Lord my healer. You are the Lord, don't He let me, don't He let me, you are the Lord, my healer, you say, you say to one, and you my sins, you are the Lord. Thank you, Father. Danke, Vater. 
Thank you that we can remember you. Danke, dass wir uns an dich erinnern dürfen. Jesus, you took the cup. Jesus, du hast den Kelch genommen. And you say, take and drink. Und du hast gesagt, nehmt und trinkt. This cup represents my blood. Dieser Saft, dieser repräsentiert mein Blut. The blood of the new covenant. Das Blut des neuen Bundes. We thank you that we are in a covenant relationship with you. Wir danken dir, Herr, dass wir in einem Bund mit dir sind. Is a covenant of forgiveness. Es ist ein Bund der Vergebung. Is a covenant of peace. Es ist ein Bund der des Friedens. It's a covenant of healing. Ein Bund der Heilung. We thank you. Wir danken dir. And we remember you. Wir erinnern uns an dich. Taking this cup. Nimm, wir nehmen diesen with thankfulness in our hearts. Ich mit Dankbarkeit. And we say thank you. Und wir sagen danke. In Jesus name. In Jesu Namen. Amen. You can partake of the cup. Lass uns davon trinken. Amen. Amen. Thanks. I give you thanks for all you Just pass the cups to the altar ministers. I am so My soul, so much rest all over. I give you thanks. Thank you, thank you. I give you thanks for all, all you have done. I am so blessed. My soul, soul is at rest. All of you, I give you thanks. Thanks, thanks. I give you thanks for all, for all you have done. I am so, I am so, my soul, my soul is at rest. Oh, I give you thanks. Danke, yes, Ich gebe dir Dank, worauf du hast. Ich bin gesegnet, ich bin gesegnet, meine Seele geht uns ohne Hand. Ich bin gesegnet, ich bin gesegnet, meine Seele geht uns ohne Hand. I am so much, I am so blessed. I am so blessed, I am so blessed. 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 I am so blessed, my soul is at rest, oh, I am so blessed, I am so blessed, I am so blessed, my soul, my soul is at rest, oh, ich bin gesegnet, ich bin gesegnet, meine Seele Ich bin gesegnet, ich bin gesegnet, ich bin gesegnet, meine Seele geht uns ohne Hand. Ich bin gesegnet, ich bin gesegnet, meine Seele geht uns ohne Hand. Ich bin gesegnet. I am so blessed. 
Hallelujah. Father, we thank you that we are so blessed. And I want to speak your blessing upon your people. I want to speak that none of us who are here, none of us, our lives are not going to be the same again. Dass unser Leben nicht mehr gleich bleibt. We are so blessed. We have confessed it. We are so blessed. Wir haben es bekannt. Wir sind gesegnet. And you go out walking in one blessing after another. Und wir gehen hinaus in einem Segen zum nächsten. One favor after another. Eine Gunst zum nächsten. One open door after another. Amen. May the Lord bless you. Der Herr segne dich. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord cause his face to shine upon you. Der Herr segne dich und bewahre dich und lasse sein Angesicht leuchten über dich. May the Lord be favorable to you. Und der Herr sei dir gnädig. May the Lord bless the work of your hands. Und der Herr segne das Werk deiner Hände. May the Lord give you prosperity. Und der Herr gebe dir Wohlstand. May all be well with you. Und alles sei gut mit dir. Amen. Jesus name. Jesus name. Amen. Amen. And the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. And the love of God. Und die Liebe Gottes. And the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Und die süße Gemeinschaft des Heiligen Geistes. Be with us now. Sei mit uns jetzt. And forever. Und für immer. Amen. 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 Be blessed in Jesus name. Dein Segen in Jesus name.